After a long night, the petals are done, and Nastasha can begin painting the tears. She mixes alcohol with various shades of food colouring to create a dappled effect. So I want to go quite deep on some parts and light on other parts as well. So it also gives me an opportunity of making some of that quite vivid and then pushing some of that into the background. Once the paint is dry, Nastasha moves on to the stenciling. Basically, it's really simple, just lay it where I want it and then just use royal icing to scrape over it. I love it, but it's peeled off a little bit of my paint. That's only because it was still a bit wet there. But with more tears and petals to paint and the wire frames to tackle, time is running out for Nastasha. It's going to be an all-nighter job, but it, all in the name of cake and art. At her studio in Lancashire, Molly's finished decorating her surprise makeup box cake for Olivia's 21st birthday. So 